Hello, this is Mr. Chabry, and today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. Uh, we're going to be doing a reaction video. Uh, so this is actually the first video I ever posted onto YouTube. So this is actually predates my Mr. Chabry channel, at least by five years, uh, because this was actually posted in 2008 on a, on a channel that no longer exists. I, I scrubbed this thing off because... As you're going to see, this is going to be kind of cringy. So, yeah, 2008, that was back when uh, skits were like the big thing on uh, on YouTube. Uh, so this is basically going to be a skit that I did way back when. And I did not make scripts for these skits or anything. I would basically just start recording and trying to craft a story out of that. Uh, so with that, uh, let's go ahead and watch this. Of course, I want, I want to have a little cringe meter here, and I'll let you know where it is, um, if it's like low, medium, high, or if it explodes. So, let's go ahead and start this video. Sir, we need your help. Okay, right off, right off the bat, it's already exploded. Um, oh, oh, gosh. So, as you see here, I've got toilet paper taped to my upper lip. Yeah, it, it, oh my gosh, ooh, um, that's cringy. Uh, so uh, yeah, this this uh this meter here already exploded. Uh, let's go ahead and continue watching. Hey, where's the fire? All right, I don't know what's going on with my hair in this. My hair is like all over the place. Look out the window, and you will see. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Look at this beautiful countryside. Alright, so yeah, for some reason, I thought it would be funny to, you know, have it where it's like, look out the window to see, you know, what this big threat that this guy just roamed into. I guess it's supposed to be his house. I don't remember. And I thought it'd be funny if he just looks outside and is like, look at this beautiful countryside. And then we start hearing Beethoven. I thought that was pretty. F Listen. My comedy bar was on the on the floor. This is 2008 YouTube. Um, yeah, this was this was back when um, randomness was considered funny on its own. I mean, for some reason, it was super funny. And these are like probably just images I found on Google search. Here's one that I put upside down because well, that's funny. But yeah, this, like I said, this. This is just uh, a lot of cringe. Look to the right, you fool. All right, so for some reason, I thought it'd be funny if, you know, he says, look to the right. I look to the left. That's how bottom of the barrel we're talking. You're on the right. Every, every time I see that toilet paper. <gasps> All right, so this was, <clears throat> this was made in Movie Maker. Well, that's why there's not a lot of complexity to this thing. And also, I just want to point out, my camera angles suck. I, I, I filmed this literally with a camera, like, like putting it up here and, like, talking to it. So, yeah, not very good angles at all. Uh, plus, we had that little um, filter, the little rainbow color filter that they had in Movie Maker back in the day. I thought it'd be cool to just use that. To make that by tomorrow morning before dawn, that object will strike the air surface, storing life as we know it. So I just threw out a bunch of dialogue. Like I said, I didn't script any of this. And there, I just threw out a whole bunch of uh, setup there. A lot of information just thrown. And oh my gosh, this is cringe. <laughs> There's me trying to convey disbelief. Okay. I've probably found this on Google search as well. The, world, sir. the end is near. How am I supposed to stop this? Alright, and you must go far to get under it and shoot it with this top secret super gun. I used a literal water gun as a prop. Uh, a top secret go, super gun. Like me, you know? <laughs> my, my nervous go. You are our only hope, sir. No, I I'll give it a shot. Man, it kills me every time it goes back to the toilet paper. Oh my gosh, no, oh. Please turn the camera up. Oh, that is cringe. I'm, okay, I'm pausing right here. 
Wow. Oh, I didn't even, I did not even notice that when I recorded that. The camera was at that weird angle. That is cringy. Um, anyway, this song that's here is not originally what was on here. Uh, like I said, I made this back in 2008. Uh, I think before the Viacom stuff. That's when they got really strict. Uh, so this was actually originally copyrighted music. Uh, this was Message in the Bottle by the Police. And, of course, uh, over the years, you know, YouTube got stricter at having music on their videos that shouldn't be there. Yeah, all, all this stuff got taken down. I'm not complaining. And there I am with brown shoes just walking around. Um, uh, I used to wear brown shoes. Wait a second. Wait a second. Hold on. Let me pause. Why? Why is there a lollipop on the ground? Why is there a lollipop? Listen, this lollipop here, in normal circumstances, would have been forgotten to time. Someone threw it on the ground back in 2008. But the fact that I recorded it here just gave it a sense of immortality. Uh, it's, it's going to exist now in this video format. Uh, here we are in 2020 talking about this lollipop that just wanted to disappear from existence back in 2008. 12 years ago, wow. But yeah, I'm just walking here. My brown shoes. For some reason back then I... Oh gosh, no. Uh, oh, cringe. All right. Went to the bathroom. Where is that fool? And here's this guy looking out the window. And like I said, bottom of the barrel, bottom low bar comedy. Oh, this guy was in the bathroom for a while. Oh my gosh. Now I'll point, I'll point the camera back at the sign just in case you forgot. Oh God! What am I here for? All right, so this part, I, I was okay. I was recording this outside. Well, there was a bunch of people, <laughs> and I was like so worried about you know being embarrassed that I was just here talking to myself. So I decided, why well, don't I just you know hold the camera down here so no one can see it? Also whisper what I'm saying. I get this weird angle. Like look at this. I don't even look at the camera anyway. Yeah, what in the heck am I thinking? And then, okay, so it took them, so the, the, it got dark, like a passage of time thing. It took them all day to get out to where he was, and it took them less than a second to get back. Oh, hi, dude. How did your mission? Gosh. I don't, oh my gosh. Oh, I don't, I, this, I, I, I can't take it, ever. Go, sir. But I'm yeah. So I asked him, "How did your mission go?" You saw it out the window. You should see, right? That's what I went out to do. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Here I try to open the blinds with the water gun prop, and you can obviously see that I failed. And I tried again, fell again. And I just pretend that it's open. Watch that again. I just That's pretend it's open, I and I'll look do. out. Obviously closed blinds. Look at that. I'm like, oh, those will work. You idiot! The world's going to end because of you! You fool! Uh, and then we go to, like, a little still image. Um, it's going to go back and forth. Uh, this originally had the song Line of Fire by Journey, but that's copyright, too, so I can We're just... Oh, God, you can see that even in more detail with the photo, the little toilet paper. We're just going to go back and forth. And, um... Ah. Uh, I thought it'd be funny to have a little picture from Peter Nose phone in there. I'm the barrel guy. Bottom low bar. Uh, and then we just have a little transition to from the end is near to the end. <sighs> that was epic cringe. Oh my gosh. My cringe meter exploded in... Like the, like the first second. Oh my gosh. Well, I just reacted to the first video I posted on YouTube, guys. Let me know what you think about that. Like, did you cringe or... Yeah, you cringed. I'm, don't, don't answer that. Actually, you can answer that. I know you cringed. Go ahead, leave a thumbs up if you want. Leave a thumbs down if you want. I, it don't matter to me. I just... I just dropped a bunch of paper. Anyway, um... 
subscribe if you haven't, and I will see you in the next video.